is the Andesio look in the scenario in which I continue my What If Germany Won World War II series. Well, what if the Axis? As you know, the Axis lost their life in Part 5 after World War III began. But we still got the like, co-prosperity spare, which is falling. But the scenario could have went anyway, but this seems like a realistic way. Japan have a civil war, Germany get attacked by free France and leads to an outbreak with a few other nations. Japan fall into civil war with movements into the north by Russia being done into Manchugo. With America and allies deciding to take more islands as they're about to land in mainland Japan. Well, not mainland. Hopefully not. With them moving here. With America deciding to land in Korea. But Japan refusing to surrender. But some of its groups help rise up to prevent the scary aspect. And well, the invasion of the liberation of Mongolia begins. Or what? This is what the... Soviets call it. With America seeing they need to land in Thailand at this point. With Thailand, this is with Britain and France and allies. Oh yeah, this is how I've ruined Africa. Maybe when independence movements happen after this, we'll all be fine. With the mistake being made by the mapper. With British forces mostly and a bit of American forces moving into this area. Former British Raj. And while an American landings happen all over the front, with them trying to kick Japan out of mainland Asia, which is going really well, despite lots of harsh fighting resistance by Japanese forces, mostly what's left is, well... Chinese and other groups, like Mongolians and stuff. With their puppets just literally just letting the occupiers take over in some aspect. With the eventual collapse due to lots of armed groups. With an invasion of mainland Japan proving impossible. With America developing the first no-no weapon that had happened in another video but they're only tiny not that small let's give it 20 so you can actually see where it is I'm with one flying here in the two cities that they did in real life I think they're around this area with Japan surrendering once and for all as the end of World War III has happened, and the fixing of the world. Although, don't worry, Russia's also a lot stronger. Like, I mean a lot stronger than it was, but it's probably so much weaker, it's probably not going to become a superpower like America in this timeline. And let's see how the peace treaty goes. America being reformed. A new alliance is formed called the Russian League. It's with Russia and its allies and occupation zone. Alliances, not really alliances, or really the two sides. Basically, probably will be an alliance. It includes the Western occupations, which they, as you can see, they split up Germany a lot. They decided to make that state smaller so they could give some more German occupation to Russia. And Russia also keeps Eastern Europe, like, in our timeline. Except the borders are different. As you can tell, India is much bigger. But when the partition of India comes, it'll probably be a bigger Pakistan. And a bigger Bangladesh. But not a bigger India. And, well, at this point, that's all for today's video. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Wild Mapper out.